Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the 6 through 12, with a few fifth grade additives um, later on, uh, spring concert. Uh, we have a pretty large show for you this evening, so I'm going to keep this short and sweet. If you wouldn't mind, please making sure your cell phones are on vibrate. Please avoid flash photography. Uh, but otherwise, take as many videos and pictures as you want. So we really like the exposure. Uh, with that said, here's our sixth grade band. We're going to do a tune called Prehistoric Suite. It should, if you could close your eyes and imagine yourself in Jurassic Park. Okay, that movement was called Stegosaurus. So if you can imagine the Stegosaurus is trampling across the prairie. Uh, this next one uh, has significant value with the trombones doing some slide work. And it is Barontosaurus. Last, or no, not last, but not least, that's right. This one uh, is a little bit more mellow and talking about the lyrical gentle giants of the sky. Here's pterodactyls. Thank you. 
Last but not least, you got to close your eyes on this one and you're going to imagine the biggest fight of your life. Here's the Tyrannosaurus versus the Triceratops in the battle. Hey, okay, give us just a few minutes to get out to 7th and 8th grade. The only thing I really want to note about this group is we did flip the first and second piece. We're going to do Chimes of Liberty first, followed by Dr. Rockenstein.
gobble of instrument malfunctions in the middle of the show. Um, that's just the way it works, though, sometimes. She's doing all right. Um, the tunes that we played, Chimes of Liberty and the next one, uh, were the tunes that we took to contest. And we did receive a two rating at contest. So that I was very proud of these kids. We worked really hard to get that. And uh, so please, a round of applause for these children. We're always reaching for that one, and we're going to work toward it, and I have, we're, we're going to get it one day. One is our goal. Next year, right? Yeah. That's right. That's our motivation. Okay, well, anyway, here is Dr. Rockenstein. Kind of has a little bit of a Halloween feel to it. Again, uh, you just can't have a concert with a little bit of rock. Next one, I always like to end our concerts with the Little Pep Band, and we have a special guest conductor this evening. I'd like to introduce Kanye Cross. <laughs> anyway, we are going to do that, and I'm going to sit and play with them if you don't mind. So here is Cold Hearted. Hello, my name's Kanye, and 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 today, and we're gonna do Dr. Right. I mean, cold, cold hearted.
The next tune that we are going to play is called Chant and Savage Dance, and it's going to give you a little bit more of the reservation, the Native reservations, and, and a little bit of the uh, Native American feel. Uh, so here is Chant and Savage Dance.
Before we play our last tune with the high school, uh, there's just a few awards I'd like to give out to a, couple, a few students here. Uh, the first ones, uh, in the fall, there's a KMEA District Honor Band that you uh, students have the option to audition for and uh, if selected, obviously go and perform up in Dodge City with uh, a group of Southwest Honor musicians. And we had two this year, and I'd like to recognize Abigail Scott and Hayden Gardner. Need more hands, too. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. And last but certainly not least, there is an award that is uh, awarded to senior, uh, one senior student uh, who has displayed exceptional uh, leadership and, above all, musicianship, um, and that is the John Philip Sousa Band Award. And this year's recipient is Liza Ward. our last tune again it's a little pep band song and here's uh oh wait wait i forgot we gotta invite our guest conductor um kanye cross can you join us please okay and here is metallica's inner sandman
1941. I put my corduroy breeches on. I put my corduroy breeches on to work upon the railway. Billy me hooray, hooray, Billy me hooray, hooray, Billy me hooray, hooray, to work upon the railway. In 1842, I left the old world for the new. Oh, spare me the luck that brought me through to work upon the railway. Billy me hooray, hooray, Billy me hooray, hooray. Without a stocking or cravat And nothing but an old straw hat While working on the railway
on the river on the Ohio. I hold the boatmen row, floating down the river on the Ohio. Oh, the boatman is a thrifty man. The son can do as the boatman can. I never saw a pretty gal in my life. That she already was a postman's wife. I hold the postman row, floating down the river on the Ohio. I hold the postman row, floating down the river on the Ohio.